Hello everyone, in this video we will see about upgrading the firmware of Genesis Platinum 4410 ONU. Normally it is not recommended to upgrade the firmware for a perfectly working device and for a wonderful device like Genesis there is no need to look at the issue at all. This being a normal case, recently several people started reporting that their voice is not working in their Genesis devices. The random sample kept increasing rapidly that at a point we couldn't ignore it so we looked into it and the issue seemed to be real and upgrading the firmware solved the issue so anyone facing the similar issue this video may help you. Getting into the video as usual we will connect the modem to the laptop, open a browser, enter the default gateway of the modem. Enter the login credentials and log into it. Those who are not aware of the login credentials, it is admin for username and MAC address of the modem in capital letters for password. Once logged in, you can find that the hardware version of the device is V2.1 and the firmware is dated to September 2020. So we will get into the upgrading process. Listen carefully here as the upgrade process is not a usual one. Normally we will go into maintenance or manage in case of genesis and look under device management but in this device there is no option to upgrade in any of the columns uh, thanks to a random blog on the web I have found it out. What we have to do is uh, keep the interface to default and when you look at the URL column at the top of the browser the URL goes as 192.168.1.1 slash cgi bin slash content dot asp what you have to do is remove the vat content from the url and replace it with upgrade so the new url is 192.168.1.1 slash cgi bin slash upgrade dot asp once entered and press enter button a new window opens which we couldn't find anywhere in the interface strange right okay moving on you can upgrade the firmware by two means either by using a rom file or the format mentioned as tclinux.bin currently we have only the bin file so we will proceed with that method it's quite simple once you click the bin option click choose file select the upgrade image and click ok at first the file you selected will be uploaded onto the modem and as you can see in the screen a line is line in red says that it is processing it takes usually longer than other modem brands and also there is no timer to indicate the process if you look closely the wi-fi di disconnects all of the sudden which is an indication that device standoff and it is rebooting again so once again the device reboots it takes you to the main interface that is the login page you can enter your credentials and login and once logged in you can find that the firmware of the device is upgraded by either looking at the firmware version or by looking at the build time. Forgive me for blabbering all throughout the video. The process is quite simple. You alter the URL a little, upload the file, it's done. The file I used is for Platinum 4410, device running on hardware version 2.1. You can find the upgrade file in our telegram channel by visiting or contacting us through the telegram channel, you can get it. Also a reminder, there is another hardware version which is v1.0, I will also add that file in the telegram group. You can find your hardware versions and uh, use the correct file. Thanks for watching. Kindly subscribe to the channel as that would help us progress and encourage us to make a further more videos in this regard. If you like the video press the like button. If you have any critic, kindly drop in the comment section. 
for help or assistance contact us through sm platforms and once again don't forget to subscribe see you and meet you again in the bag full of tech informations bye